Hey YouTube friends, this is CC Cartwheel BSG coming at you with my week 24 update. I had my vertical sleeve gastrectomy surgery on June 23rd, 2015 at Stanford Valley Care Medical Center in Pleasanton, California with Dr. Maria Stockery. My high weight was 266.1, my surgery weight was 256. Last week I came to you at 194.8. And this week, I am at 191.8 for a three pound loss, which I'm stunned and excited by. Um, total weight loss is 74.3 pounds, and since surgery, 64.3 pounds. Um, life is good. I, I have no complaints. Um, it, 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 I'm pretty stunned. I'm pretty speechless. Um, I am beyond the point now of thinking or having a lot of doubtful thoughts that weight loss surgery is not going to work for me. As long as I work it and I do what I'm supposed to, I have feelings now that weight loss surgery is going to work for me. Um, however, having said that, um, not to bring this party down, but it, there have been times within the last week or so where I look in the mirror and I don't even know who that person is. Um, I laugh about it and I joke about it, but the reality is, is I've been overweight my entire life. So I'm in some uncharted territory. I mean, I'm wearing clothes that, uh, I probably couldn't wear since I was in my 20s, 20 plus years ago. Um, and it's great. And I'm not complaining. I mean, this is the best decision I've ever made. But I, I sometimes don't recognize the person in the mirror. I know it's me, but I don't know what I'm trying to say. It, it, I'm having a little bit of an identity crisis. And... I'm excited, but it's uncharted territory. And the bottom line is, is that this is great for my health and I'm, it's the best decision I've ever made. But sometimes when I look in the mirror, I don't know who that person is. I know she's me, but it's, I, I have, I have to work on the head stuff, I think. Um, so I'll keep you posted on that. I'm still excited. Don't get me wrong. This is the best decision I've ever made, but I'm just uh, not recognizing the girl in the mirror. So I'll be working on that. Or maybe I'll just get used to my new face. I don't know. Anyway, anybody that's been out further than me, do, do I sound like a complete lunatic or do you know what I'm talking about? Um, I'd appreciate your thoughts if you want to share with me. Um, sick. Crap. I got the worst cold ever. Uh, I don't know if you can tell in my voice, but I'm not even going to tell you what my steps are because I took, th I've taken three days off. Yesterday I walked 8,000, uh, 8,000 steps, but Saturday and Sunday I didn't even walk because I had a fever with this uh, cold. I did get the flu shot this year, but that meant nothing. I got super cold, went into my ears, just gross. I hope none of you get it. Please wash your hands, take your vitamin C, drink your water, do anything you can so you don't get this cold because it is not fun. But I'm on the tail end of it, so I'm getting better. Um, but stay healthy, y'all. Take Stay healthy. Do what you need to do. Um, I did enter Lauren Losing's diet bet, holiday diet bet, so I'll keep you posted on how that turns out. Um, but, you know, anything to motivate, keep me motivated throughout the holidays, I think is a good thing. Um, all right, sorry to be so short with this, uh, but that's all I have. I'm fighting the sun going down. Remember, do something extra, extra special for yourself. You're worth it. Besides your program, do something, treat yourself well. You're worth it. I'm worth it. Have a fantastic week, everybody. Stay safe. Stay not sick. 
I will see you next week for week 25. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.